day, Infinite Music. The sun is out, and it's so exciting to be back live in the classroom with Infinite Music. It's a great opportunity for young people to experiment, to explore, and to have the creative time for musical fun. And with that spirit in mind, who better to tell us how they feel about being back in our Making Music After School program than our elementary Infinite Music makers themselves? Listen to what they have to say. I'm all, I'm, uh, I can't even, I can't even, can't even see what I'm gonna say. I can't even talk, it's crazy. But so then I wanted to play the trumpet. And um, I, I didn't realize it would make your lips that numb. <laughs> <laughs> In class, I, a lot, like, so we have this thing where if you want to use the bathroom, you just go by the door and wait for the teacher to notice you. And I, feel, I have the worst luck. Like, she never notices me. So I, I, I just, like, make up some random melody and, like, um, just um, just start playing with, like, my fingers, like, really loudly yeah. to get her attention. Yeah. Like and, the Wee Wee song. <laughs> <laughs> the Beatles songs like uh, the words to them I don't like it like a good chunk yeah like I got this my mom's I got like the strumming to the songs uh I, I mastered the strumming of most of the songs especially paperback writer was really easy to find strumming to it's just like I'm not very good at chords do you listen to music at home do your mom or dad play I music like or? listening to Ellen De Ribby which is it Ellen De Ribby <laughs> It's from the Beatles. I, I always get like way really nervous, mm -hmm. but yeah, like when, once, I get, that, yeah. once I get once I get on stage, I feel always nervous. Uh -huh. Noah, he's probably ready to yeah. figure out home. <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. Oh, it's the well, I guess that's the end of the yeah, interview. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think music brings to your academic life or just your life in general? Uh, it it really. It makes me happy because music's like, it's fun to listen to, it's fun to play, you can mix it up, uh, you can, it's, it, it's just fun to play, it's like, when you listen to it, it makes you happy. Yeah. So, music can like, express emotions, and for me, it helps me, like, because I have like a bunch of stuff going on, like, I got a bunch, like I got uh, softball, karate, and then I, I have a bunch of stuff every Very day. Very structured things. So too. music music helps uh, a lot with that. Yeah. So it's fun to play. Does it I, help you yeah. focus? Yes, very much. Because music. Can if really I can't focus, with... if I can't focus with math, I uh, I play the trumpet or the piano. Yeah. So basically. <laughs> <laughs> matters why is it is why is it important it's kind of like a way for people to enjoy like long car rides or just something to distract you and entertain you mm -hmm. there's just something about it like you can catch the melody of it and then you sort of start like catching onto the song and then it gets stuck in your head and then you want to learn it I guess um, I do practice at home for band mostly. And what other instruments do you play? I like you to play the bells, um, and also I like to play the snare drum. Okay, so, so so you're a man after yeah he's gonna after be house. Right? You are into percussion. Yep. Pound out a couple of beats on that thing. Yeah. Normally, like rock music, like 
Maybe like the Beatles. Oh yeah. Like the Rumble Wars or like the oh, Maybe terrible. like hard hard rock. I could listen hard rock, classic, emo, um yeah, um funk sometimes. Pop on occasion. When when you're listening to that music, do you, do you just feel like you want to be playing the drums to it, like stay yeah. stay in rhythm with it? Yeah. Like today, you did in class. Today was pretty cool. You were playing yeah. Surfing USA. Yeah. And keeping that. I mean, there's. I can feel that natural rhythm. It's fast. Like, it's really fast. The tempo is probably at least 180. Yeah. What do you like most about them? Well, I like it because you, I can play like all the instruments in band. Like I signed up for percussion, and I'm never gonna get, I'm probably never gonna play like the flute or the clarinet or the trombone this year. But here, I, I was able to try the marimba. I, I got to play the piano. I got to play all the different types of drums, and that that was fun. And then the, it's not, it's not as structured. It's like not as um, like together. And mm -hmm. if you mess up, nobody really cares. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's good. It's supposed to be fun. It is yeah. after school. I I think it's a great place to go and just like calm down. It's not. It doesn't feel as pressuring as school does. It is a place I can relax and just jam and play drums or piano or whatever. I like it because um I I get to learn how um I get to learn how to do drumming. Every single time when I go to Jamie, I feel happy because I can learn more instruments and chords. Mm -hmm. Yay! Oh. Very nice. At home, I just kind of like make up little random rhythms, and I'm surprised I remembered that one. Um, I um, do sometimes do like recordings on a computer. Oh, you do? Yeah. What, what, like some kind of a program that you have on yeah. your computer and you'll record yourself playing? I have a mic and an interface, but I don't use the interface to record guitar, bass, or keyboard. I don't record any of, they're mainly loops that uh -huh. you can put in and play with. I normally just do vocals. But I look at these kids and they realize they can do, they can try new things. They can take risks. They can actually in music you actually make mistakes, and it's part of the learning. And you learn that you can't be perfect, but you try to be excellent. And you and you just but you also work, so you make less mistakes. And so I also and I also thought like in this drum class, the it's the creativity that they get to do, where it's a small group. So if someone says, Hey, can we do this now? You can let them or, Hey, can I play the bass drum now? And there's just so much more opportunity when you do an after school group like this to let kids try things that in a class of 30, sometimes they, they get lost. And so I think that's part of it. It's like, it develops just more than music. It's just this ability to, to take risks, try things, perform in public. Kids have clarity and see things as they are. They may not know your name or why you donated, but because of your generous spirit, many more young people can experience the transformative power of music, and for that, we are grateful. Please help Infinite Music continue our mission to develop and support innovative, robust music programs with accessibility for all kids. There are infinite ways to give. One, two, ready, go.